Olympic as well as uh, referee Indusena says go for this uh, particular encounter. Vidyata with possession early. Taken down. Good, uh, good uh, start uh, for Vidyartha College. Uh, a, a messy pass from the scrum half. Given to Jason. Jason uh, gives it to his outside centre. Outside centre to wing three quarter. Uh, they have a speedy back line. Uh, that's Vidyartha College. And uh, referee uh, in the Sena says uh, the line was offside uh, for St. Joseph. So the first uh, penalty for Vidyartha. Yes, uh, the captain Jason says that they are going to go for the three points. Uh, they want the early lead and they want to draw first blood here at the Nittavela against St. Joseph's. Scrum off uh, for Vidyata College, uh, gonna take the kick, uh, CJ Fernando. Fernando pacing himself. Uh, this will be a huge uh, confident boost uh, for Vidyata if they can uh, nail this kick. No, uh, the flag stay down, so it's a no-go. So the scores remain uh, nil all uh, at this uh, game between St. Joseph's and uh, Vidyartha. These two team have, uh, teams have uh, contrasting size of play. St. Joseph's uh, mainly heavily rely on their pack, uh, their burly forwards and uh, on the other hand Vidyartha rely on their speedy backs. So restart uh, from St. Joseph's. Check and uh, collected by the fly half, uh, steps his way through. Bandara, Bandara refuses to go down but eventually taken down uh, by the Joseph's defense but uh, still possession is with Vidyartha. Number 4, the lock forward uh, Ratna Divagara marauders his way through, Jason uh, takes the ball, the number 8, he runs through and he touches down for Vidyartha in the first two minutes of the game and they open their account and uh, they are in front by 5 points, Jason the skipper doing the work for Vidyartha College. So uh, the conversion uh, to be taken by the scrum half, CJ Fernando. And uh, the conversion goes astray, but uh, nonetheless, uh, with the college in front with five points, we are still in the first uh, five minutes of the game. So, uh, Joseph with the restart, uh, the fly half uh, kicks off a decent kick, it's hanging in the air, but uh, cleanly collected by the Vidyartha skipper. With the Arthur with possession, he uh, goes up and under, he elects himself. Brilliant, brilliant piece of rugby, but he goes down. But uh, that was the uh, number 13 for With the Arthur College. They are showing some promise and they are threatening to run this ball uh, too far from uh, St. Joseph's. 
They don't, I must say that the home team have dominated. Uh, the home team has dominated in the first few minutes of the game so far. St. Joseph's uh, haven't been able to really come up with anything to pressurize uh, these boys from Vidyasda. Shramov uh, gives it to his uh, fly up, who gives it to the outside center, who made that brilliant uh, move. Uh, yes, TADK Pereira. Pereira goes down. And uh, handling the ball inside the ruck. Uh, so uh, it's a penalty for St. Joseph's. That infringement, uh, relinquishing control for Vidyartha. And uh, Joseph's opting to go for touch and uh, he finds touch, the fly half. That's uh, Rehan Tyagaraja. This uh, was an encounter that uh, promised a lot, uh, bit overshadowed uh, by the game happening at Palle Kale. It's a big, big, big game uh, at Palle Kale today. Trinity taking on St. Peter's. Two other heavyweights uh, in schools rugby and uh, two schools fancied for the title these year as well. So uh, we are bringing you live pictures of that encounter also. You can check the scores of uh, Trinity Peters and uh, Vidyartha versus St. Joseph's on the score of LK. <coughs> so, uh, referee making some things clear to the Vidyartha team. Uh, obviously, not happy with something, uh, referee in the Sena. Stramov cleans up, gives it to his fly and a missed pass, a brilliant uh, work done by Vidyartha. They're gaining uh, valuable yardage, uh, they have uh, controlled most of the position in these first few minutes as well. So it's another scrum down just inside the 40 meter line of uh, the St. Joseph's half. The play has been predominantly in the half uh, so far in this uh, 8 minutes. Josephian uh, scrum half breaks, uh, rather the flanker breaks. That's uh, Chirat Peris. Peris gives it to his lock forward who goes down. Uh, in a heap, still position with uh, St. Joseph's number 8 uh, trying to maraud his way through but taken down. Now the number 13, uh, Joseph's with an opportunity, they have numbers on the outside but the fly up opts not to pass and he himself breaks through. Will he have the legs to go? Yes he does and he touches down. <coughs> Touches down right under the post and it's a score and they equalize with their tries in Joseph's. <laughs> Rehan Tayagaraja was the try scorer and uh, It's 5 all at Nittavela with a conversion to come for St. Joseph's. It, it is a fairly simple one. I do, you don't get uh, simpler kicks than this in uh, schools TIA rugby. Yes, he gets it right. The flags go up and uh, St. Joseph's edge ahead. And uh, that's 7 points to 5 uh, is the scorecard now. So Joseph's... Uh,
So, uh, restart by Vidyartha College, uh, taken by the number 8 of St. Joseph's. Possession uh, is with St. Joseph's. Uh, the fly half ups to thumbs it down. Collected cleanly by the Vidya, the fullback. Some fancy footwork from uh, the fullback, uh, number 15. Lakmal, my Lakmal. Was the player who uh, showing uh, a bit of uh, acrobats there. So, uh, nonetheless, uh, position turned over by uh, St. Joseph's, uh, trying to chip it over and uh, collect it himself, but not uh, successful on that occasion. Vidya, the with position. And uh, a thundering tackle uh, for that uh, outside centre of Pereira. Again with the threatening with uh, some fast uh, moves. They have a very speedy back line. If you look at the seasons uh, so far for these two schools. With the other start of the season off uh, against uh, Isi Padana. Uh, we'll get back to that. Uh, look at this run from uh, <coughs> the Vidyata skipper Jason Ekanayaka. Runs through and scores the second tie by his team and the second try by himself. So Jason Ekanayaka, I beg your pardon. The Sri Lankan youth player last year. And he is uh, showing that he's made a class. And uh, that's the second try running through the middle without easy as you like. And uh, that's the second score and with Vidyartha go ahead with that try. So it's 10-7 now. It looks like a try fest here at Nittavilla today. It is going to be an enthralling encounter no doubt. You don't get um, simple clicks than this. Yes, he gets it right. So uh, it's a goal uh, for now it's uh, twelve. Points to seven at uh, Nitha Villa is the score. And um, again St. Joseph's on the back foot. They were beginning to take control of the game uh, with that try. But uh, Jason Disanayak showed uh, what uh, class he possesses by that uh, magnificent run uh, through the middle. So uh, St. Joseph's uh, fly half uh, this time with the restart. Dinesh De Silva. kick uh, not carrying uh, 10 meters so uh, it's a scrum down at the center line with the other pressure seems to be telling on uh, St. Joseph with the other college so you are talking about the seasons that they have so had so far with the other open their campaign raised their curtain uh, against uh, Isipadana college and uh, it was a wonderful outing for them as they Made the runners up, uh, defending runners up of the league, uh, settle for a draw and this time once again the number 15 runs and gives it to the fly half. Again a brilliant running move from Vidyata in just uh, feet away, mere feet away from the try line they are now. Yes, it's an uh, infringement uh, from the St. Joseph defense. Handling the ball in the ruck, uh, says the referee. So. Uh, it's a penalty for Vidya the College. They have the luxury now. It's a very dangerous position for the visiting team. Gives it to the lock forward. 
plenty of uh, Josephian uh, players converging on the lock forward. Jason, Jason, will he be able to make the hat trick? No, he doesn't. He gives it to uh, the number 11. Number 11 uh, stopped uh, by the Josephian defense just a mere meters away and Josephians uh, turn that over and a brilliant counter-attack move from St. Joseph's the winger running down the left flank will he have the legs uh, he doesn't have the necessary support he needs with the other turns it over now they have the numbers and number 14 tries to run uh, through the middle by himself uh, meets the burly prop forward who takes him down Referee playing advantage, spotting an infringement uh, on the part of St. Joseph's this time. Yes, uh, it's a penalty for Vidyartha College. And the referee want to have a word uh, with the Josephian uh, skipper. Obviously, he's not happy with something that happened. Making a note of that uh, is referee in the Sena. It has been a very uh, fast game this so far. The, uh, it's a very big made uh, team uh, St. Joseph's. They rely heavily on their forwards. So if this pace continues uh, for a while, their stamina will surely be tested. With the other exploiting that uh, fact, exploiting that uh, fact that they have a speedy uh, back line, they have uh, taken it to their advantage so far in this game. Clean line out from uh, Vidyata once again. Gives it to the skipper. Skipper gives it to uh, the number four. Ratna Divakara, the rock forward. Still position with the Vidyata. Fly half Pereira gives it to the other Pereira, the outside center. Fly half was Bandara, I beg your pardon. Again Bandara. Bandara to the prop forward. Samarakon. Samarakon goes down. Vidyata holding a bulk of position in this first half so far. Bandara gives it to uh, the center, center who goes down, cleanly collected by the strum half here, uh, but uh, taken down, again referee not happy with the tackle, uh, it seems, uh, was it a high tackle, we'll have to wait and see, referee in the center not happy with the tackle, sending him off, sending him off for that tackle, number four has been sending the uh, High tackle, referee was not happy, he's not uh, going to take any hanky-panky today. He sends him off, uh, sending a clear signal, so it's a penalty and uh, Jason kicks it into touch. So uh, 14 uh, place 15 as far as the numbers go here at uh, Nittavela grounds today. St. Joseph's, uh, they are under a lot of trouble now. They have uh, one less uh, man to defend. An infringement uh, from the home side gives uh, the ball to St. Joseph. So uh, they relinquish control. Uh, St. Joseph's camp will uh, breathe a sigh of relief. Uh, had that uh, score been made. It would have been a very difficult position for St. Joseph's to be in. They are already down three points, but uh, within striking range they are. So, uh, and the news from uh, Pali Calais is that uh, St. Peter's College and Trinity College between the game between. Uh, from the game between uh, St. Peter's and Trinity, the scores are 10 all. So uh, it's a neck and neck encounter there at uh, Pallegali today. One of the most anticipated uh, games of the season, Trinity versus St. Peter's. So getting back to the action here, uh, 
St. Joseph's with possession and gives it to the fullback. Fullback uh, thumbs it down. Uh, does he find touch? No, he doesn't. Uh, not the best of uh, efforts, I must say. He should have kicked it into touch and got out of jail, but uh, not to be so. Vidyata with possession. Bandara now gives it to Jason. Jason uh, avoiding three tackles, but uh, taken down eventually. Bandara cleans up. Bandara goes for a drop goal effort. Uh, it had the direction, but not the legs. It went under the post. So, uh, Captain Jason Dishanayaka not uh, happy with that effort from Bandara. A calculated risk uh, taken from the scrum half, not paying off this occasion. So, restart from St. Joseph's. A fumble, but cleanly collected uh, in the end by the number 11, Salinda. Now gives it to uh, this Josephian uh, fly half. Rehan. The boily forward taken down brilliantly by uh, the flanker for Vidyartha. Number 8 avoiding two tackles. Yes, the number 14 taking him down eventually. Not the prettiest of tackles you may see, but effective. Giving it to the prop forward. Jackson, Goshen Jackson goes down. Number 14 now. Acting as the fly half. And the flanker botcher said uh, showing butter fingers. It's a knock-on. Referee spots that and brings play back uh, to that position of the knock-on. It was uh, Piris Chirat uh, Piris uh, who was guilty of showing uh, butter fingers there. For the viewers who are joining just now, uh, this is the game between Vidyartha College and St. Joseph's College played at uh, Nittavera. St. Joseph's of course uh, down by 3 points now. Vidyartha, Vidyartha down by 5 points I beg your pardon. Vidyartha 12 and uh, St. Joseph's 7. So it's a timeout. Uh, there, there's a... Substitution made. 